How's it going everyone and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I'll be teaching you guys how to link your WordPress account to your bank account. So without further ado, let's dive right in. So to actually do this, um, it is only achievable through a plugin with WooCommerce, or I should say under WooCommerce called WooPayments. And the reason for that is because all of the online transaction methods or payment gateways are widely supported by WooCommerce, or I should say WooPayments. And the integration for it is quite simple. And all you guys have to do is make sure that you're logged into your WordPress account as an administrator. So there are actually two ways to do this. You could either click on your plugins tab, like so, on the dashboard. And here you can actually navigate through the compatible plugins for your WordPress site. So here you want to type Blue Payments. I believe I already have mine installed. So anyway, we'll get to that later. Okay, so here we are. As you can see, it's already integrated into my uh, WordPress account. All you have to do is um, navigate to the dashboard like normal. So normally it would be uh, on the left-hand side of your screen, as you can see here. So the plugins would appear here. So you guys want to click on WooCommerce. So there are actually two ways. You could either click on WooCommerce as normal, or you click on the payments tab right here. So the easy way is to actually click on payments and you'll be met with this page right here. So from here, you guys want to click on finish setup, scroll down and click on continue, and actually wait for it to load, and you'll be redirected to this page right here. So it, it will ask you, I'd like to set up, oh, it will ask you if you, you would like to set up payments for your store. So you just want to click on agree, continue, whatever. And normally, um, it would ask you to sign up for an account if you're not logged in already, so let's actually go back and continue in sandbox mode. Actually wait for it to load. And assuming that you guys are logged in and you have an account going for you, um, you'll be met with this page right here instead of this one. So all you have to do is actually make the link between your WordPress account and your bank account. So you have two options here, being bank account and debit card. So this choice is entirely up to you. But because we're trying to link our WordPress account to our bank account, you want to make the selection right here and choose from the list of the supported bank accounts for WooCommerce and WordPress. So let's say, um, hypothetically, my bank is linked to Wells Fargo. So I would just click on it, continue, and it will take you to a new page where you get to enter your bank details manually. So all you have to do is fill in the boxes and add the information accordingly and hit save and you guys are done. You've successfully added a bank account to your WordPress site. So there you guys have it. Hopefully this video helped you guys out. And if it did, be sure to let us know down in the comment section below. And if you guys want to see more videos like these, we do have a YouTube channel where we do guys like these daily. So if you guys want to show your support that, you can do so by subscribing to the channel. So with all of that said, thank you all for watching and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.